Radhe Radhe, going to answer another question that was posted on our YouTube channel. This one is from Agishan and he asks, how would one go about changing their way of thinking? And this question is in relation to a video we had posted called, Where Do Good and Evil Qualities Come From? In that video, I had mentioned that good and evil qualities are inherent in everybody's mind because our mind is material. It's made of mayic energy and maya inherently has good and bad qualities. Therefore, our mind also inherently has good and bad qualities. And it becomes a question of which of those qualities we develop through our thinking. So he's asking, how do you change your thinking? Well, the only way to change your thinking is by thinking. Our mind is always thinking something. So if we can direct our mind towards something positive, that is going to improve the quality of our mind and develop the good qualities and gradually reduce the bad qualities. Now, how about if someone has a habit of thinking about something negative or they're in a negative uh, feedback loop of thinking about something bad? If Generally, what people try to do is think, okay, I have to stop thinking this negative thing. That doesn't really work. You're just reinforcing that. You're, the thing you want to stop thinking about, you're thinking about, that you don't want to think about it. So it's just getting reinforced. Instead of that, we should just replace it with something positive. Choose a simple devotional truth like Krishna is with me. Krishna loves me. Krishna is sitting right here inside my heart. I belong to Krishna. I've been with him since eternity. He never leaves me. Any of these simple, positive, philosophical truths can help direct our mind away from that negative thinking. So instead of ceasing the negative thinking, just replace the negative thought with a positive thought. And whenever the mind goes back to that negative thing, bring it back to the positive thing. Eventually, you'll train your mind. And in this way, the more we focus our mind on positive devotional thoughts, the more purified the mind will become. And of course, we also have to practice devotion. So by practicing sadhana, by doing rupdhyan every day, we, on a very deep level, start cleansing the mind by creating a state of union with Sri Krishna. So really what we're trying to do is bring God into our mind. And the more we can do that, the more our positive qualities will develop, and the more the negative qualities will decrease. Jai Shri Radhe.